happy vlogmas day two it's so exciting and someone is very excited about it it's miss emmy and i'm very excited because this is the first year i've ever gotten advent calendar for miss emmy and we're gonna we're gonna open it up i actually have my advent calendar we're gonna open and we have miss emmy's advent calendar so let's get started <laughs> We're going outside, but we're not. We're not going to do a WALK. Anyway, this is the advent calendar. It's from Trader Joe's. Open. This is day one, right there. We're gonna open it up. Okay. Ready? What is it? Oopsie. I think I I tore it completely off. I think I wasn't supposed to do that. Merry Christmas. Happy. There you go, good girl. Happy Advent! Okay, I just took my dog out on a walk because we saw some friends in the dog park and it is so muggy. It was so cold earlier this week and then it's Florida. It got very warm again. But I'm gonna open part of my Advent calendar now. So I have the 12 Days of Beauty calendar for Trader Joe's. This is Advent calendar one because Advent is 24 days and this is my 12 day calendar. But we're gonna start with this one. All right, so open day one, open sesame, okay. There's two, there's three. Where's number one? Oh, here it is. Merry Christmas to me. Right, here's the day one. Brazil nut hair mask with shea butter. Avant calendar day one. <laughs> I don't sound that excited, but I am. I think it's pretty cool. I have no idea what to expect in the 12 days of beauty calendar. I didn't even think Trader Joe's had that much beauty, so I was like, oh, we'll see what happens, but uh, that's pretty fun. Uh, it's so hot right now, especially for December. Okay, so I did a little bit of Black Friday shopping, so I thought I would open some of my Black Friday shopping too. I'm using a bottle opener because I love to throw on the table. I was opening cans of root beer with this bottle opener, so very not exciting bottle opener, bottle opening reasons, whatever. Apparently, uh, there we go. This is my Sephora, Sephora Black Holiday Friday haul, and it's actually not that exciting, but what, whatever. It's always nice though when you get things in the mail. So I love this facial cleaner. I have used it for like five years. It's this kale, green spinach, vitamin U to the people facial cleanser. It is so nice. As you can see. It is very green. It was not on sale for Black Friday, which is unfortunate, but I needed a new bottle because I'm almost out and I went ahead and bought it on Black Friday even though it wasn't on sale. I don't think it ever actually goes on sale, which is unfortunate, but if you're looking for a cleanser that will make you feel fresh every day, I highly recommend it. And then this was on Black Friday sale. It is the Sephora branding eyeshadow. I recently got the Selena Gomez eyeshadow, but I want I don't want to invest in like I don't want to always use these like fancy name brand eyeshadows. Like the Selena Gomez Rare Beauty eyeshadow is fine, but I want to try this is only five dollars on Black Friday. That is a deal that one cannot give up. And I have a present for my significant other over here. Let's open this up. This I got on a really good Black Friday deal. So normally this product was $90 and I got it for $57, which I thought was a spectacular Black Friday deal. Look at this cool box. Look, look, look. Okay, so if you are dating me, you need to stop watching. But I don't think he's gonna watch this, so we're good. I should have just grabbed a knife, but this was already on my coffee table, so. ADHD, leaving things around the house for a win moment, except it doesn't work to open things. We're pretending it's working. I haven't decided if I'm gonna give him this before Christmas or if I'm genuinely gonna wait till Christmas. It is so difficult for me to wait for Christmas for these presents. Like, how do people do it every year? I am struggling. I've already, I'm making a Christmas, he's out of the country right now, he's on a trip. So when he comes back, which will be in like three days, I'm so excited. Um, I 
and making a Christmas basket of like Christmas items. And I'm wondering about this in the Christmas basket. Anyway, it is from Brooklyn. And it is, <laughs> he's good. I think he's really gonna like it. Okay, it is a super soft plush robe. Oh my gosh. Um, I might just give it to him because I, I don't wanna wait. I, do, I really don't. Congrats on all the, it says, Congrats on all the relaxing ahead of you. I'm super tempted to give him this before Christmas because it's December and you might need a soft robe. Anyway, and I opened the box, so maybe you're supposed to just wrap the box. Well, you tell me, do you wrap the box or do you open it and take the products out and then wrap it? Let me know in the comments what you do. I'm really, gen I genuinely don't know. I have one more present that, well, my hands got really big there. I have one more present for him that I got on Black Friday. I think I'll show y'all now. And this one I'm definitely going to wait for Christmas because it is like my big Christmas present. Okay, here she is. And I think it's beautiful. I'm so excited. I think this is, I'm a nice person. I'm a good girlfriend. Anyway, these are New Balance golf shoes. And I guessed his shoe size, but I'm pretty sure I got it right. Anyway. If I didn't get them right, I can return it, but like, they're beautiful, they're beautiful. I am so excited, I'm so excited. These have been like, when I thought of presents for him for Christmas, I genuinely thought golf something because he loves golf and golf tennis shoes, New Balance, he, all of his tennis shoes are New Balance and I like New Balance, so I like knew he liked New Balance. So I like decided to get this as his big Christmas present I got it on Black Friday on sale, which is really exciting. Um, anyway, the sale was like genuinely, I had list, I looked at the price in October and then I walked like price tracked it. So I did see like the genuine Black Friday price was genuinely a sale price and not just a fake sale. So I am very pleased with that. And do I, do I wrap the box or put it in a gift basket? or like a Christmas gift bag. Let me know what I should do because I have genuinely no idea and I, I don't know. So let me know what I should do folks. I just wanted gas because I only had 20 miles left to my tank and I'm going to go play disc golf with my neighbors. And this has just been a fiasco. The first nozzle I pulled up to at the gas station, broken, not working. And so I was like, I'll just wait for the person in front of me to leave. Well, I park, I wait and wait and wait, and then he goes inside, he finishes, and he goes inside the gas station. I was like, no telling when. So then I was like, oh, I'll just go in between him and the car next to him and turn around. I couldn't, I would have gotten stuck. So then I had to do a three quarters turn and I almost got stuck. And then I pull up to the pump and I was too far away, so I had to pull out again, back up again. Ah, <sighs> it's just a fiasco. I just wanted gas, why am I so embarrassing? You can't even read the numbers, can you? It's like $30 right now. $30 for gas, I have no money for Christmas. What's it called? Vlogmas. It's where you make a vlog every day till December 25th. Yeah. yeah. Cool. It's like a yearly tradition on YouTube. It's already recording now? <laughs> nice. My other one's over by that other piece. So the end of my vlogmas day two is going fantastic. It's 12 50 in the morning. Uh, I don't think you can see this. I don't know if it's gonna focus. Yeah, there it is. It's 12.50 in the morning and focus on me now. Uh, okay, it's 12.50 in the morning and I'm having to take an Uber to work because my parking garage gate decided to not open in our parking garage. 
and there was like four cars parked in front of the gate like waiting for it to open and it was broken obviously <laughs> um, and I called our emergency maintenance line and they were like yeah um, it didn't answer it just went to voicemail it goes to the voicemail and then the person on call is supposed to like hear it and come get it very ineffective so that's the end of my vlogmas day four is me standing in my stairwell at my apartment having to uber to work love it love it